guys, it's me, Tori, and I have some things I want to tell you. Um, first, let me just apologize right now for the screaming kids in the background. If you hear them, I promise they're not being abused. They're just beating the crap out of each other. Okay, so, yeah, they probably are. They're probably arguing over some of the dumbest things ever. But I, as a parent, need to choose my battles more wisely, and sometimes they need to learn how to work it out themselves. So that's what they're going to do. Um, so if you hear them screaming like that, please forgive me. This video should be quick and short, and I hope that it gives me the opportunity to do something else after this. If not, I'm going to take about 50 takes, and uh, I don't have time for that today. So let me give you the update. Right now, I am currently sitting in the sunroom, and this will probably be the last video that you see of me in the sunroom. Why? Because I'm moving downstairs. So I've noticed that when I've tried to record videos that I have a nosy neighbor. Yeah. And occasionally I get like amused by something outside like the woodpecker. Get out! Or a kid. Yeah. So I get sidetracked. And amused by something outside a squirrel squirrels fighting squirrels jumping off of my garage roof yeah it's funny no not really um so of course <laughs> I'm moving downstairs all this crap is going downstairs well maybe not the desk we'll figure that out still but I'm moving downstairs because I plan on recording during the evening, late night, like, not late night, but I like to sleep, so I like to go to bed around, like, 10, 11 o'clock at night. I gotta get up at, like, 6 a.m. to get kids ready for school, so, yeah. I like my sleep, um, but, like, 9 o'clock at night, I plan on recording videos once all my kids are in bed and all that jazz. Please excuse the dog snoring. Um, I want to avoid that, too. <laughs> So, I'm going downstairs, taking all my crap, and I'm moving downstairs. Now that room has no windows, so I have to create lighting, which is great, because I have a whole entire softbox kit, and I have my ring light, and I'll be able to make high-quality videos in peace and quiet. I know, right? So, I'm looking forward to this. This weekend is when it's happening. So, the next video you see will probably be me downstairs in a dark gray room. I might put up a, a piece of fabric, some sequins, maybe, maybe, um, as a backdrop, or just put up a backdrop. I got a purple one somewhere. It's in the garage somewhere. I'd have to find that too. Um, so yeah, I'm moving. Holy shit, I'm moving. Oh man. Oh well. We're on to bigger and better things. I want my YouTube channel to grow and I don't think it's going to grow with me sitting in this echoey room with nothing. And since I really can't record videos during the day and it's a little bit easier at night when the kids are in bed and they're not screaming bloody murder or requiring assistance from me or Kevin requiring assistance from me to help him <laughs> wrangle some kids. Um, <laughs> so yes, I am in the process of doing that and I also have some other things that have been going on, um, but those will be another video somewhere along the way. I will tell you that I want to start uploading every Thursday and Sunday at 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, so look forward to two videos a week, every week, hopefully from here on out. This video right here, the one that you're watching me in, hopefully will go up today, January 19th. Mm -hmm. I know I haven't recorded a video for all of January, and I don't have a resolutions video, like I'm not making a New Year's resolution, I am not going to say, oh, I'm going to lose weight and whatever, I'm going to try and lose weight, sure, great, but I'm not putting it out there like that, like I want to use YouTube for accountability and for helping others, that I might do. 
Um, I would like to do a 100 day challenge, but 100 days is a long time, especially in my world. Like, are you for real? 100 days of no soda, no sugar? Oh, crap. Those are my two favorite things. Yes. Yes, they are. <laughs> um, so, yeah, I want to do a 100 day challenge. And I just purchased another Beach Body workout program. Turbo Fire. I think that's what it was. See, I can't even tell you what it is. Like, I know I want to lose weight. I know I'm overweight. I know I need to lose weight. I know I would look a whole lot better if I lost weight. My face has gotten really round. My body has gotten really round. That's the only shape that I'm in. Um, so I need to lose some weight, yes. But I don't want to make it a New Year's resolution that I'm going to fail at. I just want to take every day, one day at a time. So if I want to screw up and have one soda, or ten. Yes, yes, mm -hmm, ten. Then I'm going to do it every now and then. Maybe. We'll see. So if you want me to do a 100-day challenge, like... Like workout challenge I might be coming up with one in January sometime my beach body program is not supposed to be here until the 24th so if I get it on the 24th I'll start on the 25th no point in wasting time and I'm just gonna jump right in so Rex stop snoring holy shit dog um so yeah look forward to new videos and Hopefully I can become consistent with two times a week and go from there. Maybe then I might upload every day after I've gotten consistent with whatever I'm doing. Consistency is the key to everything. Losing weight. Eating healthy. Being responsible. <laughs> but, you know, consistency is where I need to get better at. I need to get better at being consistent with everything that's going on in my life. I consistently have sucked at life for the last 31 years. How's that sound? Okay, okay, okay. All right, all right. This year I want it to be different. I want to succeed at something. I want to succeed at losing the weight that I want to lose. Am I going to lose all of it in one year? Hell no. If I do, that's even better. But I probably won't. I have a lot to lose. A lot that I want to lose. Is it my perfect weight? No. Is it what I want to lose? Yes. Am I going to get there? Maybe. We'll see. One day at a time. 100 day challenge? Can I do it? Probably not, but I'm at least going to try. Like, I'm going to be honest. I, I probably can't do it. Um, even with Kevin's support and whatever, I don't think I can. Like, I just don't really have the consistency gene in me. Like, I've never been consistent with anything. I struggle with consistency. I struggle with routine. I struggle every day. As a stay-at-home parent, I struggle every day with routine. Now, if I wasn't a stay-at-home parent, I think that I would be less likely to be in this rut that I'm in, and I probably would have already lost the weight that I want to lose by just moving more um, and being active. But because I'm home all the time and I'm not as active as I should be, it makes it hard. So, you know, maybe I will do like a 100 day thing and then I'll just like condense some of like the the video together. Like make it like three or four videos. One minute please, go. So yeah, that's what I plan on doing for the month of February basically is starting my 100 day challenge in January, finishing it and April? Is that right? March? February, March, April. Roughly middle middle of April, end of April. Right before my 32nd birthday. So, yes. Yes. I am going to do a 100-day challenge starting January 25th. If my new workout DVD gets here. In the meantime, I'm going to start throwing out the crap in my house that I don't really eat. 
or I shouldn't be eating. I'm gonna drink all them sodas though first and eat all them Girl Scout cookies I just bought from my husband's cousin. Damn you, child, damn you. <laughs> I love you, you're cute and all, but do you have to sell Girl Scout cookies? Can't you just sell some weight loss products? Come on, Girl Scouts, get it together. Please. Please sell something other than cookies. Although, you can send me the, the crack, I mean the, the Thin Mints. Yes, send me your Thin Mints, please. Those are my favorite. And a box of Tagalongs, too. <laughs> Sorry, I can't, see I told you, sugar is like my weakness. Sugar and soda. Cookies, Girl Scout cookies. I would eat a whole box of those while pregnant, and thank God I'm not pregnant, because I'm not doing that again. So, yes. Thanks for watching and look forward to new videos. Hopefully I'll have one up on Sunday. But first, I must get downstairs and clean out that room and set up all my camera gear and all of my stuff. So thanks for watching and I really, really hope to have this video up today and I hope to have a new one up on Sunday at 6 p.m. So thanks for watching and tune in next time for a new video. Bye guys.